Kerry Cox was able back when McKinney was a small town to advise people and counsel those that helped shape the growth of McKinney and how that would look. How would McKinney look in 20, 30, and 40 years? And he had wisdom beyond many and was willing to share that wisdom with people of influence in McKinney. And those people you can look today and see uh, his counsel in some of the actions and some of the ways McKinney has grown. He was my father and he was born in McKinney, raised in McKinney and began his career in McKinney in the 60s and truly was a mentor and a friend to anyone that came in contact with him. He used his gifts and talents for many good purposes. He was uh, president of the Rotary Club, very involved in his church, the First United Methodist Church in McKinney, very involved in the Chamber of Commerce, uh, was very instrumental in founding Collin College. He was the original uh, founding board chair and served in that position for 15 years. And if you know anything about Collin College today, it truly is one of the great success stories of our region. So Kerry Cox was um, diagnosed with leukemia in 2001. He was chosen to carry the Olympic torch at this time. His church family uh, selected him to carry the torch. Uh, so he got suited up and dressed up and, and carried the Olympic torch through downtown Fort Worth while going through leukemia treatment and in remission, out of remission. And then in 2002, he passed away. He taught us to be strong and taught us during his cancer treatment that things were going to be okay and that bad things happen to good people. And it was an honor to call him our dad. He was one of those leaders that showed people how to grow McKinney and how to grow the region. One of the things that would be important to Kerry Cox is that future leaders carry on and continue that focus on being the best you can be, sharing the talents you have, and continuing to help make McKinney the best it can be.